Would you look at that lazy guy? Buddy! There! There's my boy! He's got to sleep right next to me. Hi guys, um, I hope you liked that little preview of our little buddy boy. He's sleeping right here beside me. He's just got to be, if I'm in here, he's got to be under the covers or laying right beside me, one of the two. Anyway, I got a couple of uh, subscription boxes today. This is my, one of them is my last one. The other one is one that I told you about a few days ago that I am keeping. And this one here is only four times a year. So um, I am going to keep that one because I was very quite impressed with it. So um, excuse the no makeup. I just got out of the shower. I moisturized and that's it. I colored my hair because my son, daughter-in-law, and two grandkids are on their way from Portland, Oregon to Mitchell, South Dakota, where I live, um, for Christmas. And they've been on the road since Saturday night. Um, it is Monday night now. So they stayed in Montana, in Spokane, Washington the first night with her dad. Then they went to uh, Bozeman, Montana and spent the night. And now tonight they're going to go as far as Deadwood, South Dakota, and they're going to stay there. And then it's like three hours to me. So I'm excited. So anyway, I had to color my hair and I did my nails last night. Um, not as impressed as I thought I would be with my nails. It's a really deep red color. And then I put um, glitter polish over it, you know, for kind of festive. And it's got really big chunks, and I'm not real happy with it, but I was not going to redo it. So, anyway, such is life. So, anyway, this is Pop Beauty. This is my last one of this. I had or When I first ordered it, I ordered three months. Um, so, that's what I got. And actually, this month is the best of any of them. <laughs> okay, I got a makeup brush, an eye brush, which I absolutely love these brushes. And I don't know, it almost looks like an e.l.f brush um let's see here those aren't elf that's not elf actually elf says elf on it and this has nothing on it so i don't know what it is but anyway i i have an obsession with eye brushes so i'm happy to get that and then that there was also a little um kind of burgundy velvety bag in there and in that is earrings and I will pass those along to my uh, daughter-in-law because first of all I have such sensitive I'm very allergic to a lot of metals so I have to be very careful about what I wear and earrings tend to rip my ears so I don't wear earrings hardly ever once in a great while so I will give those to her. This is why I'm doing this, so I can give a few presents to them for Christmas. And then the bag is quite interesting. I'm going to give this to my granddaughter. But it's it's a little, like a little purse type. And I think my granddaughter will like that, actually. It's got, it's kind of glittery and um, stuff. Okay, so it's got three things in the bag. First thing is um, a Maybelline Superstay 14 Hour Lipstick, and it is in the color, let me see if I can read this, not, probably not, um, 090, Endless, rain maybe but this is what actually here this is what it looks like here um and it's in the brown color that is very popular this year but i am not sure that i like brown but this might be okay on my lips i don't know it's very silky feeling um i tried one of these one time quite a while ago and i wasn't impressed so we will see and the next is by Peter Thomas Roth, Clinical Hair Care, Mega Rich Conditioner, rich with biotin B7 complex, vitamins C, E, and 
Provitamin B5 for soft, smooth, nourished, manageable hair. I will definitely use this. I like to get shampoo and conditioners. Oh, the only thing is I wish they'd send shampoo and conditioner when they send this stuff instead of just the conditioner. I always, if, if any of you are like me, I always have conditioner left after I use up shampoo and conditioner sets. <laughs> always. Okay, and the last thing I'm very happy about, Laura Geller. And it is uh, Baked Impressions Eye Palette. Express so yourself. And it's, they're very pretty. Very pretty. I'm actually very, and th they feel so nice. Let's see here. If I can do this. Hopefully you can see those. The first one is very light. But the other two... Aren't they pretty? I am really impressed with that, actually. And as you guys know, I love Laura Geller. So, all right. That is my pop beauty for this month. My last one. Now, it almost makes me want to keep getting it after this month, but I won't. <laughs> because the first two months were... This one month does not make up for the other months being bad. Okay. So then... And if anybody else has this problem, please tell me. You open a box, and then you can't get anything back in it the way it was. I got my BFF box today, and I'm going to keep this subscription because I was so impressed with this the first one I got. Um, God dang it, everything's falling out here. First of all, this is on top. It's a little cardboard thing. It tells you how to do a... Um, perfect unboxing, which I'm sure I don't do it right. But, oh well. I get to pick this paper up here. Sorry. This is got, it, this is curated by Bethany Moda. And this is Winter Essentials, and it tells about um, what's in here. It doesn't tell prices or anything, but it tells what everything is. And it's Bethany Moda with a big old glitter ball. This here is just for your Betsy. Use codes Bet Betsy's. Give your BFF $5 off their membership, BeautyCon BFF. So, if anybody would like this, there it is. Okay. Go to town, girls. First thing in here is, which I'm giving to my granddaughter, is Disney Minnie Mouse jewelry-inspired tattoos. I mean... I got to tell you, I think these are the stupidest things to get in boxes that there ever was. And it's quite the deal, but I just, I think they're stupid. <laughs> so, they are going to my granddaughter. Um, oh, God dang. If, if I didn't have a hundred things on this little, little desk. And this is an Essie nail polish, which I like Essie nail polishes, but I, white. This is going to my daughter-in-law. But it is in white. It is called Marshmallow is the name of it. Essie nail polishes, though. I'm quite impressed that they put Essie in there, to tell you the truth. Next thing is Soap and Glory, and that is Hand Food, Hydrating Hand Cream, which it's got shea butter. Wait till you get, guys get old and you have to have one of these things. Shea butter, macadamia oil, and marshmallow. Okay, that's it, I guess. But that's what that is, so I'm happy to get that. I have water in my ear. Okay. Next thing is um, one of the Revlon Color HD. I saw um, somebody else do their unboxing, and I thought, oh, no, it's going to be the one I've got. It's not. So I'm very happy about that. Um, I, as you guys know, I was not real impressed with the last one that I used. Um, it was a shade lighter than this. It just didn't last. But I'm hoping it was just that lipstick because the, uh, I have two of them. And the other one worked great. But um, the last one that I used did not stay. And I just was not impressed. This one is, if I can see what color it is, Passion. This is passion. 
And that is so pretty. It is so pretty. Let's swatch it. I'm going to put this down farther. That way I've got the I have got the name of of it because otherwise it is not anywhere on the package. Okay, let's swatch this. Oh, it is so pretty. So pretty. I like the way they smell too. They smell like um candy. So pretty. Okay, so the next thing in here is another color pop item, which I love color pop and I'm very impressed that they put color pop in here. And I hope they continue to do that every single month. This is Super Shock Cheek. But um, I did open this and look at it, and it stole the show, is what it's called. And when I looked in there, it was just kind of crumpled up. I flattened it out. So you can kind of see where it was. There's not much in there, to tell you the truth. See, it was all kind of just crumpled. But you can move it around so easy because it's just like putty or something in there. But this is what it looks like right there. Hope you can see that. I put it up here. So pretty. I will definitely use that. I have one highlighter from them, and um, it's not that. So, okay. And then this is so cute. This is a, a baby Nike box. And what it is is a twenty-dollar gift card. Redeemable only at Nike.com for women. And it's a $20 card, um, or $20 off $50 for that. And I was kind of happy to get this, too. I did not see the other person haul this. Let me get this off. But I love little notebooks. And this is a gold goal digger <laughs> how cute but it's just really a notebook and I love this kind of stuff I just because I love to take I take notes on um, my crafting stuff Ooh, blind you on all my crafting stuff and that kind of stuff so okay and another thing I'm giving my granddaughter is <laughs> Bethany Moda is is an advocate of Disney as as far as I know, and so I will be giving these to my granddaughter along with those tattoos. Okay, and there's another one that's um I don't know how to how, know how to say this Aeropostale, Aeropostale. How do you say that right? And it's Bethany Moda. See, um, by Aeropostale. I'm going to say it that way because I don't know how else to say it. My gift to you, uh, Bethany Moda, $10 off any purchase of 50 or more. Valid through December 31st. Okay. And the, nope, there's two more things in here. This one here is, I do not have, is the something, push-up drama mascara. Falsies push-up drama mascara in the blackest black um, Does not say if it's waterproof or not. I, I kind of like waterproof mascara because my eyes Washable mascara darn it um, I my eyes uh, leak a lot <laughs> Okay, so I will try that for sure and the last thing in here is a Murad hydrating toner so I am pretty impressed with this I mean with the color pop and the soap and glory and the lipstick and the notebook and the gift cards oh there's one more thing Garnier Fructis style new full and plush root amp root lifting spray mousse Boost volume, no sticky way down. 
with cotton flower extract. I think I'm going to give that to my daughter-in-law too because um, I have enough volume to my hair right now. I do not need something like this unless I would use it on top where it's getting kind of flat. I'm kind of liking this color. <laughs> it um, it always looks really dark when I first do it because I'm so fa so fair skinned. But within a few weeks of me washing it every day, it um, fades out and by the time I'm ready to color it again it looks horrible as far as I'm concerned the color um, just fades out to nothing it um, almost lighter than my natural hair color was although it's hard to tell what my natural hair color was now because I'm gray but anyway so if you like this kind of thing and again, I'm sorry I didn't do this on the weekend. I normally would, but there's things in here that I want to give for Christmas, and I can't do it if I wait to haul this. So um, if you like this kind of, of unboxings, please give me a thumbs up. And I love you guys so much. And I know this is going to go up after Christmas, but I hope you had a wonderful Christmas and a very, very happy and prosperous New Year. Bye-bye.